Hola everyone, your chess puzzler here and welcome to the channel. Just a quick reminder of what is just around the corner. This is the main event for the next few days and it's a tournament that every chess player should know about. It takes place on an annual basis and this is what we have and let me bring this up for you. First are the dates. Kings starts with the rapids followed by the blitz games. The prize fund is also included for those who wish to know what money is available. And of course, we have the official commentators who are going to be covering the game live. What else do we need? Okay, I hope this is good enough. The dates and timings of these events. All games start at 1300 hours sharp, local time. And the tournament will last until Sunday the 24th. So for those who are interested in the blitz portion of games, these take place on the last two days of the Kings. 24 rounds, so there will be plenty of games to be covered. Who's going to be there? Well, first of all, this guy, Dominguez, who has a staggering 28-16 rating, playing for the States, but Cuban-born. Then we have Mr. Wesley So, who had suffered a bit in recent times which also explains the four in his own ELO ratings. But Wesley is Wesley, so do you expect it all? Then we have this chap, who's also suffered a drop in his own ELO rating. But Harry Krishna is as sharp as the Indians come. OK, who's up next? This is the pride of the Czech Republic, who on a good day will surprise even the very best. He was not as active as he used to be. But he's around, so do expect him to be on top of his game. Okay, and here we have the rest. Mr. Naka is going to be there. And when it comes to Naka, he's something else. He's one of the fastest players we have around. He has done very well in recent times. And check out this Elo. Do expect him not to disappoint. This gentleman is up next, and he needs no intro whatsoever. If you never heard of him, well, maybe you need to visit the doctors. The thing with Fabi is that he's very much a classical player, but with an elo this high, he too is capable of doing wonders. Our next player is this guy, Bulgarian born and raised. Topalov is a true chess legend. He became a GM at the age of 17. By the way, Top is also the world champion of 2005. A great player and a great guy too. His games are simply fascinating because he loves taking risks. Next on the list is Krzysztof Duda of Poland. He became a GM at the age of 15. His rating is on the up and has had plenty of achievements under his belt. Let's see how he does in the Kings. Our next player is Rapport. Now, he's something else. Hungarian born, Richard is loved by many. Very inventive, very energetic, and we have seen how sharp he can be. Sam is next on the list, and he is many people's favorite player. Though he's down on his rating, many people are going to promote him as far as he can go. The Kings is going to be a tremendous experience for him, so let's see what he has to offer in the next few days. Rapid games are 50 minutes plus 10 seconds increments starting from move one. And for the blitz portion of games, we have a three minute game with a two second increment. The tournament is going to open with this setup. Duda v Naka. Harry Krishna is up against Fabi. Navarre is meeting Wesley. Then Rapport is playing Shankland. And on the last board, we have Topolov, who's going to play Dominguez. I just hope I haven't left anything out. So do get ready for the Kings. That is about to get started in any minute now. So until next time, this was your Chess Puzzler.